and welcome back to Minecraft. We're in episode 89. And in the last episode, I completed the first phase of my wheat farm. And I built the plot for the reed farm. The tree farm actually started to grow some of its trees. And I went back down into this cave that we've been working on. Because... I wanted to know if I could find any more diamonds. And this is getting nowhere fast. But I hadn't explored all of the ways that I could go down here. I know I didn't. And that's what we're doing now. Hope you guys are enjoying the series. Enjoying your time here. We're having fun. And we're 11 episodes from the 100th it's going to be amazing. Now, are there any mobs this way? Eh, not really. Let me see here. I had it on easy because it, you got more mobs, but I don't know. It's not. It's not working right now. Maybe if I have it on hard and I see some mobs, or or I might have to, to discover a new cave, because I would also like to find some slimes, like a whole pile of slimes, because they're not they're not easy to take out in large numbers. Slimes are really really tough in groups like that. Well, you know what? Now that I'm looking at this, maybe I did explore all of this. Yeah, I've been here before, and that's okay. Ooh, sorry, I got the uh, sniffles. Because I found some unexplored iron. I might as well grab that. Okay. Oh, you know what? Aha! I never went this way. Because I remember where I am, but... There was a couple places I had explored fully, and this is one of them. Oh, wow. There's a lot of resources down here. Look at all this, man. Iron, 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 big coal, iron, redstone, all packed in together. That's sweet. Question is, does this cave lead anywhere interesting? Apparently the answer is no, but I hear water that way, so... Let me dig it up. There's also this passage under here. And this, this little area of... Uh, Lava might actually have some diamond in it. You'd never know. Do a little digging around for that. And then I'll go get that iron and such. Because you just, you don't ever know what you're going to find when you dig around these lava pools. I can't tell you how much diamond I've found from doing that. It's not the most interesting thing to do on camera, but when you find that shimmering blue uh, silvery mess of, of ores it just makes it all worthwhile however saying that oh my oh boy oops <laughs> you moron alright so I didn't see that one coming almost got myself killed Let's go around to the other side and, and see what happened exactly. I don't remember there being a lava found or a lava waterfall over there, unless it was on two different layers. That might have been what it was. They were uh, not on the same layer. Whoa! I gotta be careful, man. <laughs> That's funny. Just enough space for the for the gravel. Well, that wasn't. But ooh, what's over here? Whoa! All right, nothing that way. It's getting kind of boring down here. This is one of the things I I just enjoy doing. Uh, however. This is getting nowhere fast, so... Let's go back to this side. Ooh, be careful, dude. You're dropping that lava and you're finished. Let's get back over here and finish getting these ores out of here, because there's a lot of them. 
Got a nice iron vein right here. Oh yeah. And more this way. And we might run into diamond. You never know, right? Right? <laughs> uh, okay. I'm not getting the redstone or coal right now because I don't feel like it. And also, not getting too much mob action. Not sure what that's all about. I'd like to know where that water is, though, because that might be New Cave. And New Cave is good. Because if I have to leave this one to, to explore another one, I will be sad. So we'll do a little bit of drift mining without the arms. I'm basically tunneling at this point. It's going to get so dark you can't see anything. I really can't see either. I realized recently that there's a glare on my monitor, and that's one of the reasons I think I don't always see the mobs that you guys see. Because I can't. <laughs> it's not my eyes. It's the darn screen. Where's that water coming from? I would like to know. Seems like it's this way, but for some reason I think I've already been wherever it is I'm digging to. Because this cave mostly is a, a vertical cave. It doesn't really go that far horizontally. And I'm, I'm amassing a lot of cobblestone here, so... Let's go back. And... We're going to go over to that uh, Swiss cheese... Oh, I didn't see this before. What's up here? Oops. Here I thought that was a skelly. Give me my arrow back. There. No, nothing this way. Not really. Sometimes that works. Not always. Alright. So let's return to the surface, shall we? Uh, gotta get rid of this water. That makes noise. Ooh, there is unexplored iron over there. Oops. Boy, you're a real, real trip, you know that, dude. Digging out lava so that it can just spread everywhere and potentially kill you. Yeah. That's entertaining, to say the least. Oh, I see. It's a dead end. But it does have some yield. And that's what we're going for. Just gotta be careful. Dangerous stuff. That's a big iron vein, though. If I do say so myself, that probably had 12 blocks in it. Which is totally alright. My question is, is this a dead end, or are we going to discover another lava pool? One can only hope. <gasps> there it is! You just never know. But how many? Is it a single block? No, there's at least two of them now, I see. There's three, there's four diamonds, five diamonds, six diamonds, seven diamonds, eight? Diamonds! <sighs> Again! Again! He finds eight diamond at once! It just doesn't get any sweeter than that, let me tell you. So now we're up to 16 diamonds. Now, I don't know. I guess I'm just good like that. But you see, I was going to leave this cave, and some of you were probably getting impatient with me. And I took just a little more time to dig around, and sure enough, I made good. Now, where the heck am I going? Okay. I was going to say, I'm lost. I am lost. Uh-oh. Okay. I know where this is, but... Where? Huh. Ah, uh, perhaps... No. Perhaps it's this way. Maybe. 
No. This goes back this way. Uh oh. Now, now wait just a darn minute. I know where I am, but it, it's uh, I got turned around here because I thought this was. Uh. Now I've been through here before. Why is it now I can't find my way? I got too excited about the diamond. And I lost my way. I bet you there's some down here. I bet you there is. There has to be. Because I didn't see any. So that means it's in the walls. Eight more diamonds. Two veins, eight diamond. Oh yeah. I don't know, man. I don't plan this stuff. Just sort of happens that way. But I can't deny myself these ores. Alright, I gotta find my way out of here. I don't know if it's day or night or anything. I am interested in that watch item that Notch is planning to add. The one that tells you what time it is when you're in the cave. I think that will be a priceless commodity. Alright, where did I... Oh, no. I just came down here from somewhere. But when I walk into this room, it dead ends. Or does it? Wait. No, I was there. It just goes this way. Oh, I hate it when this happens. I'm going to waste a whole episode wandering around in a cave. Because I think I knew which way I was going, and now I don't. I hate this too because I probably walked by the entrance to this place at least 15 times. I think this is it. There we go. Why? Why? Why did? Oh yeah. All right. It was confusing because in a couple episodes ago I fought a zombie in that space that I had to crawl through, and when I when I left I didn't go that way to leave. I thought. I went a different way, but I guess not. So now we're escaping. Now we're getting out scot free. And it's been really quiet, man. Without mob action, it's kind of boring. But at least this episode gave us pretty little diamonds. And there's so m I'm standing on top of so many diamonds, but they're just. you don't know where they are. You gotta dig for them. And digging for them is uh, not really a great. great. Uh, form of, of web show. I really just like to keep things interesting and variety and all that stuff. So I'm gonna go uh, out of this cave. I hope it's daytime. It's been about that long. But if it's not, you know, whatever. Oops. It's uh that's one way out. I'll just go this way. It's, you know, faster. I could pillar out of that pit, but right now I don't feel I'll pillar out of this pit. Create a, uh... There, it is day. Sweet. And what time of day is it? Oh, the end. Chicken! Which didn't yield anything. I would kill you, but I don't need your pork. Anyway, those uh, those mountains that I was exploring, I wanted to uh, do a little bit more of that. I want to check out some of these mountains and see what I can see. Namely, these huge, giant mountains over on this side of the canyon. Because those were the first ones I saw, and then I looked over here, and I was like, oh. But, and I said it like that too, I'm pretty sure. But I, uh, I want to know what's in these mountains, because, yeah, they look pretty interesting. And hey, something cool might happen. But it's not going to happen in this episode, because this episode is over. So, have a great Tuesday. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and, uh, we're going to have some fun. <laughs>